Hello everybody, I'm Slash and VC, and this is Vulture for NetHack. If you're joining me on YouTube, heads up, the format might change a little bit and the episodes might run a little bit long because I am streaming this live on Twitch at this time and recording it for later use. So, welcome back viewers. The continuing saga of uh, Melville the Ryoshu. Experience level 15 on dungeon level 23 took out Medusa in the last episode and is now about to attempt this god-awful maze in which the minotaurs are probably the biggest thing that I'm afraid of. And hello YouTube, this is Nymeria. <laughs> oh yeah, sorry Nymeria. No, no problem. And I'm joined as usual by Nymeria from her channel Nimcraft, who just finished her Twitch stream, just did the Medusa battle, and just did and we'll be editing for seven These years. These same mazes, and we'll be spending the rest of her life trying to edit all that footage. Since we've basically been playing this game since we woke up. And it's late. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, God. Should I even try it? I better not try one more. That's That would be a little bit reckless on my part if I was to try one more hit on him. What you need to do is eat about six royal jellies. Right. Yes. And yes. you're fine. I think I'll do is, since I know that I've got a lot of regeneration for no reason I can think of, I'm just going to stand here for a couple of seconds, and really most of my hit points will regenerate. It's just nuts. I don't have a ring of regeneration on or anything. But they just climb there. Unless, can Samurai's, is it intrinsic to regenerate? Not that I know of. Good lord. That Minotaur is bad to the bone. Hey, I killed one. You're good. I killed one. Minotaur number two proving a little more interesting. Go for a genocide run, right? Do you have a scroll of genocide? I don't have, uh, no, I definitely don't have a scroll of genocide. No, I've got a couple rings. I've got free action. I should have thought of that when I was worried about being grabbed. But um, the amulet is reflection. It, it seems to be an intrinsic because I'm definitely not wearing anything that I could attribute it to. And I'm not carrying a stone. Well, I mean, slash them, I think there's health stones. I don't think there are in this one. So, yeah. Who knows? Only the shadow. Silk knows. <laughs> Holy crap, Slash. What are you doing? Trying to kill this Minotaur. Why don't you zap him? Oh, you know what I just realized? My stash is on the other side of all that water. Right? When I want to go back to my stash for more food and stuff, it's going to be all the way back across Medusa's lair. Yeah, mind players are a good thing to genocide. Or master liches. Lip. I hate liches, mind players, and vampires. Yeah, anything that does level drain would be on the top of my list. But like, if I just read a scroll and I don't know if it's blessed or cursed and it says genocide, I just genocide kittens. Oh, right. Well, if it's blessed, you can genocide all cats and get a lot of genocide out of it. Yeah. And if it's cursed, it just fills the room with kittens. <laughs> That's not necessarily a good thing, because they don't generate uh, peaceful. Well, I guess it depends on your experience level. Whether you can handle a bunch of kittens. Yeah, try that at experience level 10, and you're going up against 10 kittens, though. I mean, ow! Let's just get stitches. Yeah, that's what they say in prison. What? <laughs> they do not say that, do they? They totally say that in prison. Let's just get stitches. It's a thing. Wow. You didn't know that? No. Hey, one of these guys was carrying a lamp. You gonna rub it? The lamp is now on. Yeah, you can't apply it. Nothing happens. Oh, you know, you didn't check to see if it's cursed. Are you wielding it now? Huh. Yep. <laughs> oh, good call. Thank you so much for no 
would have seen that. In undead prison, they say that. I would have been uh, trying to bash monsters with a lamp for yeah, a while. Yeah, you would die. You would die. I'd be like, these monitors just cannot be killed. <laughs> I can't even kill a gold golem. The sword used to rock. Oh, the mazes. You can't even really get in a hurry and start clicking all over the screen like you can in the main dungeon, you know? Which is ill-advised, but you do get somewhere. I'm not sure you'd get anywhere in here. I guess I could try it, but I'm afraid I'm going to run headlong into something terrible. Oops! Aww. Dang it! You killed R2-D12! Oh! I just did something that you do that drives me crazy, and I attacked one of these things. I see how you do it now. Yeah. It's doable. <laughs> uh, you know what? One moment of paralysis and a minotaur would be death. I'm going to leave him alone. I think the odds are pretty low that there's anything else there anyway, so. A tower of flame erupts from the floor. Your smock smolders. Your scroll labeled Temov catches fire and burns. Thanks for that. Uh, out of curiosity, can I use my... What do you get when you eat the cube? Axe? There we go. What do you get for eating the cube? I didn't know you got anything from eating those cubes. I love portable wiki silver. You're handy, dude. So is Firebrand the cousin or brother or sister of Frostbrand? Well, I'm guessing they're a pair. I'd like to have them both. I'd like to dual wheel the artifact weapons. I hear a chugging sound. You can get any number of intrinsics. There's a number of intrinsics? Really? Huh. Alright, when I get back to that cube, I'll kill him and eat him and see what happens. There's something there I cannot see that was wearing Elven Mithril. You know, I haven't experienced any waves of psychic energy yet. So I may not have a Mind Flayer on this level like you did. The corpses are acidic, but may also provide fire, cold, shock, or sleep resistance. Oh, nice. Well, I'll be eating the crap out of those. Right on. But the acidic part is that damages you a little bit when you eat it, I think. You'll be all right. Yeah, no, I'll be fine. I'll Silver go. says eat it. You should eat it. <laughs> he knows. Uh, hey, the down staircase. <sighs> that was relatively painless. Two monitors lit in the minotaurs later. I'm going to check the level with my psychicness though. See what we're up against. Looks like a regular level more or less with a uh, small zoo or throne room. <laughs> Look at that. Those are full-fledged dragons Holy I think. Holy crap. Yeah those are full-fledged red dragons and silver dragons. Hey they wow. taste like Sprite Jello. You should eat them. You just teleported in that room? No, or? I just went down the stairs. Oh, you just know that room's over there. Yeah. Uh, that's not bad. That's not too bad. No, no, that's doable. It's totally hey, doable. go tame that horse. All right. RTD 2D32. Okay, I don't know if I've got, yeah, I've got a slime mold. Do they eat a slime mold? Yes.
What D are we on, literally? Five or six? Seven. So for the YouTube audience, we're naming these horses because we started with R2-D2, something suggested by chat. Every time they died, we moved the number up, and uh, Nymeria lost a large number of war horses. <laughs> You watching the clock, dear? Not at all. Oh, okay. All right. Well, I've gotten to the throne room. Ah, <sighs> yeah. This should be no problem. No problem. No problem at all. I'm gonna attack this guy. Oh, whoo! He went right down. Troll's gonna bite it. Followed by the cobalt. These guys are asleep. They don't stand a chance. Uh, however, is this two dragons? Yeah, it's a white dragon and a silver dragon. Uh, chat says they have a good feeling about this R2. <laughs> yeah. Um, I hope none of these guys have a disintegration attack, but I think all dragons have a ray attack. I shouldn't have to worry too much. I'm going to go for it. First dragon, I hit. I hit and he hits for like 20. I hit and he hits for mm, less than 20 and goes down. Next dragon, silver. I get two hits in before he wakes up. He hits back for a low amount of damage and he goes down. Well, dragons aren't that bad. You can say that for certain. Right. If he um, left some scale mail, some scales, you can make some scale mail out of it. Yeah, it's entirely possible that I could switch up my, my armor sets with that. There's another lamp here. Here goes the red dragon. Don't ray attack me, please. I freeze him, I hit him, and he goes down. Beginning to feel hungry. I get a boulder thrown at me. Let's see what's on the floor before I move out from under this boulder. I may want to pick up the lamp, give it a try. Be nice to get a wish. While I'm standing here, I'll eat something. Whoops. I accidentally ate an ice troll. Is that bad? I don't know, it's probably fine. Probably fine. What are you worried about then? I'm not worried. Oh, why did you say oops? I just didn't mean to do it. Oh. Um, was I going to check on something before I move forward? No, because I was just going to get food out of my bag. All right, next. Bugbears drop like flies. Bugbear, no. Mortar orc, denied. Red dragon, is he going to ray attack? Probably only going to melee because I'm close up. He goes down. Next, the rock troll. He falls to my blade, followed by all the remaining occupants of the room in rapid fashion. Ice troll bites me for a little bit of damage. Drinks a potion to heal himself. Hey, these ice trolls, man. They've got some powers. Ice troll dies. Where'd the other troll go? He's looking for me. Killed that troll. More monsters in the room. Getting snuck up on by a spider. Got zapped by a wand of striking by the troll. Troll goes down, followed by the hobgoblin. Next row, hobgoblin. Next, the troll. Whoa! I stepped out of order. Get back in formation, soldier. <laughs> and that's it. That's the throne room. That was fun. You may get a wish from the throne. That's what Nymeria is always telling I me. I keep telling you that I will, you will not sit on it. I will actually try sitting on the throne this time. Oh, because sure. I silk No, because there. my luck, I know my luck, <laughs> is 100% maxed out. I mean, because I've already verified that fact. Oh, right. You should pray sometime. Pray and see if I get crowned? Yeah. yeah I wouldn't mind getting crowned before Gehenna, that's for sure. That troll corpse is heavy. Oh, I'll eat him. I'll get rid of him. Uh, I stopped eating the corpse. Try it again. I stopped again. Stone Giant enters the mix. Troll comes back to life. Okay. I sit and feel somehow out of place. 
Do it again. By thy imperious order, sire. What, what monster, monster do you want to genocide? I got a free genocide? Well, of course you do, because you're slashing BC playing as this freaking samurai. Wow. What are you going to genocide, sir? Well, um... My, we went over this list just a minute ago. Mind yeah. flayers, liches. Liches? You think maybe the liches should go? Liches do get stitches. That's what I've heard. In prison. I'm waiting for chat to weigh in on this one. <laughs> I'm thinking liches. This is the direction I'm leaning. Or vampires. Or vampires. Or mind players. Despise. I can't do them all. I mean, I'd like to uh, liches get stitches. Do it, liches. Liches it is. All liches. Please go away. Wiped out all liches. Now, should I sit again? I don't think so. You think I should I stop think there? you did good. Okay. As long as you feel that uh, I've done what I should do, I'm good. I wouldn't press your luck. All right. There is such a thing as... Dang it, what is with these ice trolls anyway? I mean, where did that ice troll even come from? He must be coming back from the dead. Yeah. And the rock troll as well. So, yeah, there's jungle boots here. Possible speed boots? I'm going to say maybe. Troll rises from the dead. Yeah. Several objects here, too. Scroll of teleport. Always a good one. Pick that sucker up. Scroll of enchant weapon. Good. By the way, tomorrow is a full moon, so uh, if you are thinking about starting a character, tomorrow would be a good time. That's right. Be lucky. Uh, worthless glass, two scrolls of teleport. Hey, nice. A set of red dragon scales. Not like That would anymore. make you fire resistant. Right. It would. I like my magic resistance pretty well, though. Um, checking all these. We got, there's a red dragon corpse here. He didn't drop his scales. Hobgoblin corpse. White dragon didn't drop any scales. Neither did the silver dragon. There's That's a chest a here. And there's another wand of lightning for my viewing pleasure. All right, I think I'm good in this room. Peaceful giant. Yeah, you better be. Do you hear what happened in that room just a second ago? <laughs> 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 right. <laughs> I want you to think real hard before you decide how you feel about me. Uh, I'm cool with you. Now, for some reason, I'm burdened. All of a sudden, did I... Uh, uh, this must be I picked some crap up that I shouldn't have picked up. Let's put something in the bag. Put that in there. Yeah, oh yeah, sure. I picked up the boots I want to identify. They're kind of heavy. That's about it, though. This is just, oh, two lamps. I need to drop the lamps. Yeah, anyone in chat want to find us on YouTube? We're on a Slash's channel is Slash on VC, and my channel is Nimcraft, by the way. Just an FYI. Dark Warrior says, how do you recommend a new player get into the game start, enjoying it, doing decent, and learn? Play it. Yeah. Definitely play it. Um, yeah, I mean, and the easier roles to start with are Barbarian is really easy because um, 
you got a lot of strength, a lot of hit points. Uh, Valkyrie, obviously, pretty good. And um, monks are real easy. Um, if you play as a monk, you don't ever have to worry about picking up weapons because you don't wield what you don't use a wielded weapon and you don't wear armor. That's my favorite class to play as. Although Valkyrie is glow growing on me. But it just depends on what you like to play as. Maybe put the mattock away to cut a few pounds off your encumbrance. Oh, I don't think I can get rid of my mattock. And you should eat that gelatinous corpse. Mm, gelatinous cube. If he will step into this hallway. Yeah, there we go. Oh, wait. No, 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 no. If this guy comes back from the dead while I am attacking this guy, that would be really bad. Let's eat we'll this eat guy. Is his corpse gone now? Completely gone? No. Let's continue eating him. I know that uh, chat said that, you know, it was... Ah! Come on, guys. Chat said it was okay to just take a bite out. I'm going to get rid of the whole corpse before I risk paralysis. It says, you finish eating the ice troll corpse and feel full of hot air. I've now picked up intrinsic cold resistance. Nice. And I'm not um, satiated yet, so I guess I'm going to eat this troll so he doesn't come back. I finished it, and it blinded me. Blinding's no big whoop for me right now, so no problem. There's also... A bunch of crap there. He's been carrying around a whole bunch of stuff. Potion of monster detection. Don't need it. Um, where did there? There is the gelatinous cube. There. Took him down. No so. problem. All right. I'm going to eat the cube and see what happens. I had to stop eating it. You feel a momentary chill. So I picked up fire, fire resistance. resistance. Hey, nice oh, tip. Nice. Chat. Thanks a lot. Uh, okay. Well, guys, give me just a second to roll over my video. That's going to conclude this episode of my playthrough. Good night, YouTube. Thanks for watching.